and the extraordinary sound of a bog oak guitar, the Kent craftsmen and musicians working with 5,000 year old materials. Also in tonight's programme, tuned in to an ancient landscape, crafting oak that's thousands of years old to produce a uniquely mellow sound. And this weekend we will keep... Now from cricket to bog oak, which is a truly extraordinary material recovered from the remains of oak trees that have been buried underground and preserved in peat for thousands of years. Now Kent craftsman Hamish Lowe has perfected the art of turning bog oak into furniture and his studio in Brenchley near Tunbridge Wells is attracting customers from across the globe. He's even supplied the ancient wood to create a bog oak guitar praised by professional musicians for its unique and beautiful tone as Ian Palmer's been finding out. The sound that took 5,000 years to mellow. This is the first guitar made from bog oak. The instrumental tone sings a song from the birth of civilization itself. And the soundboard is what vibrates and pushes the sound out, but you need something rigid and dense to hold it. Um, and, and that's where the bog oak comes in, and it, it gives it a special depth to the sound. And that will go on, that will still be ringing, and this programme will be long over. So what is bog oak? Well, 5,000 years ago, almost branchless black oak trees covered the fens. They died from rising river water. Buried in airless peat bogs, the wood remained largely preserved. Hamish Lowe from Brenchley has developed a way of turning the wood into furniture, but it took him 30 years to learn how to do it. We extract four gallons of water per cubic foot. Of course, you get a massive amount of vessel collapse when you do that. Um, it shrinks half its thickness, a quarter of its width. So yes, you're right, it's that, it's that, that drying process which makes the timber super dense. Ten years ago, wood from Hamish's Kent workshop was taken to the guitar maker Gary Southwell. The result, a musical instrument with the oldest wood the world has seen. Black bog oak starts to deteriorate the moment it leaves its peat grave. Hamish Lowe says the drying process must be even and gentle. Well you won't be able to see it but just behind me is a kiln which Hamish tells me has got some bog oak inside it that's been lying there for the last nine months or so. He's just about to open it up now. Yeah it's ready. Well all this is now spoken for. Well, I have got people that, if there's any tone wood here, there are people that literally want it all. So, yep, no, that's ready, Nicola. Perfect. From seed to tree to instrument, it's a journey of 5,000 years. Britain's hardest native wood has never sounded softer. Ian Palmer, BBC Southeast Today. Brunchley.